Hi guys, Phil here from Farmer Phil's Toy Barn, back with another review. And this is of the Minneapolis Moline U Pooler, as you can see there, big weight bracket. It is in the pooling series, just as there is, I have a video already up, I do believe, if not, I'll put it up. It is of you know, Farm All 450 Pooler, same setup with the big pooling, with the big weight bracket. And an Oliver 77 Pooler, which I don't have that one yet, but I'm looking for that one. So let's get started. In the front, you see you have very great detail. It is uh, in uh, as you can see there. Uh, the grill's very nice. Has black in the lines here. Has a Minneapolis Moline emblem and a radiator cap. As you can see, great detail on the headlights there. Great detail overall on this tractor. You have your huge weight bracket. And your little notches for your weights to sit in. It does come with four black weights, but I have them in my weight box over there. You have very good detail on your tires there. As you can see, there's tread. And all your bolts. And on your red rim, all your bolts are here. As you can see, that's red. You have a, a, a yellow cap. See, the tires do have very good tread. And it does steer. It's like a real tractor though, you, it takes a while, as you can see, right here, look right here. You can see the knuckles turn to steer it, which is cool. As you can see, let's get to the side here, Minneapolis Moline U, very good engine detail there, has your wires coming off your spark plugs and your uh, cables and wires, very great detail, as your steering arm goes back. On this side, you have your carburetor and your manifold. Great detail overall. Right here is your battery. Your flywheel spins a little bit. As you can see, there's your gas cap and plastic muffler and air, uh, air cleaner. As you get to the rear here, big, thick, chunky tires made for pulling. Spins very well. Your rim detail. As we get to the side here, you have your clamshell fenders with uh, one rear facing light. Uh, wheelie bars here and a hitch that swivels. And your seat also swivels. You have all your levers and your cable, or all your levers and your handles and your gauges and your steering wheel. Overall, a great tractor. It's, if you like pulling tractors, new or, or antique, this is a great model. I do recommend it. I believe you can get it for around $50, $60, but it would look great with a Fox Farm figure on the back here and weights on it hooked up to like a sled or something. That would just look great in the display. So I do highly recommend this tractor. And this is Phil from Farm Phil's Toy Barn saying thanks for watching.